The road to the show is never a straight path. It's an incredible story of what everything he's been through. Perseverance and, and overcoming things, you know? Um, and it's also terrible. Meet the Reds' bullpen catcher, Joe Singley. He, he's not just a bullpen catcher, like he is a coach. Seven years ago, Singley was a stud high school catcher in Delaware, getting ready to start his college career at Tulane, living out his dream until... Tore my labrum, separated my AC joint, hairline fracture in my collarbone, couldn't throw at all. For many reasons, Singley decided to transfer to a junior college near home in his first month. When I ended up getting shoulder surgery. Make that two shoulder surgeries. Puts me out the whole next year. Without playing a single inning of college baseball, NCAA juggernaut Coastal Carolina gave Singley a call. They took a chance on me, which, which was one of the biggest blessings in my life. Two months into his time at Coastal, Singley went under the knife two more times, this time a collarbone injury. You know, the whole time through this process, I kept telling everyone delusional faith. Never lost sight, like always knew it was going to work out no matter what, so I'm rehabbing through it. I get back um, fully healthy, ready to go, ready to rock. Ready to rock. Until his world was rocked. When I was just healthy, going to go back to Coastal, the doctor pulled me in and said that he could die at any moment. Singley's father, also named Joe, was diagnosed with cancer. Oh, he was my superhero. Words do me no justice. He was, he was my whole life. Singley took a semester off from school, staying by his father's bedside. If I woke up uh, the next day at 11 a.m. Uh, from the 9 to 11 little nap I got, and he was still there, you know, it was just such a relief. October 23rd, 2019. Joe Anthony Singley passed away. But the pain didn't really hit you until later on, until it's, you know, it's you go to make that phone call until you're at dinner, until you're at Christmas, and there's just like this huge hole there. Being the ball player he is, Singley turned back to the game. Finally, healthy. He was ready to catch in a college baseball game. So I come back to school right at the Rock, and I was academically ineligible. A 21-year-old kid that could not catch a break, yet his delusional faith never wavered. Not able to step onto the field for a game, but he could still help the team. On Instagram, his coach from Coastal's idea. And I was kind of bitter about it, but I, I figured, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll do it. You know, I, I really, I didn't know how the whole Instagram thing would be perceived. The Instagram thing was perceived pretty well. Over 10,000 people follow Catching Singly. The most important followers, Reds catching coach J.R. House and starting catcher Tyler Stevenson. People who understand catching, it's hard to come, come by. I'd been following him, you know, on social media for a while. And it happened to line up, like when I was messaging, messaging him on Instagram that we were up in Philly playing the Phillies, and that's where he's from. So I left him tickets to a game. I'm staring over the bullpen, watching, watching Tyler catch, and uh, JR sitting there looking up at me. I wanted to see um, kind of how he watched. So on the brink of asking him why he was looking at me in, in a Philly way, um, <laughs> he asked if, if I was Joe. And I said, yes. We just want to find those types of people that this is what they love to do. You know, like it's Friday night, it's 11 o'clock and they're watching video of catchers. The Reds found the guy they didn't know they needed. The most important part of Joe is that our players love him. They love him. I was 24 last year to a big league staff to being welcomed uh, by everyone was incredible. And everybody accepts him for who he is. Accepts and supports. Often fans will see stars of the Reds wearing Singly Strong shirts, a nonprofit that Singly started to help out families that have a loved one suffering from cancer. I think it really is a miracle landing here. From down in the count to never backing down, Singly is helping the Reds clubhouse and the lives for countless families. What do you think your dad would say right now? I don't know. I don't know. I really don't. I hope he'd be proud. Proud of a dream fulfilled, based on delusional faith. Reporting, Marshall Kramsky, WCPO 9 Sports.